Hello YouTube, this is Ruth Baskew here again to make another video. Today I am not going to be talking about dollies and I'm not going to be talking about the story I'm working on. Today I'm doing something that is different that I did in my life today. These two pictures you see down here are of the goddess Kali. This one right here is a sketch of the tattoo that I got today. I spent the better part of this day in a tattoo parlor getting this tattoo of the goddess Kali. And then there's that right there as you can see on my altar. That there is also Kali on my altar. I thought it would be cool to get a tattoo of her and I did. I got her on my right arm. And I am going to tell you now this was not easy. There was a lot of pain that went into this tattoo right here. This is not a good spot to get a tattoo, people. So if any of you are thinking about getting one in this spot, think twice, man. It felt like they were ripping my arm open. But isn't she beautiful? I mean, and it's like, I didn't think they could make something so gorgeous as this Kali tattoo. So I thought I would share that with you people today and let you know what I've been up to in my life. And um, maybe even share a little information about Kali, because she is so misunderstood. People always consider her the goddess of death and destruction, which, yes, yeah, she is. But the destruction she is known for destroying is actually negative karma, demons. She also destroys and sends demons back. Um, she will bring your ego into check if you're too ego Statistical, but she's a very loving and benevolent goddess. I mean, what mother wouldn't do anything to protect their children, right? Or any decent mother, anyway, in today's world, you never know. But yes, so this divinity right here has meant a lot to me because I've been through things in my life where instead of it beating me down and making me submissive or giving up, it just turned me into more and more of a fighter. So much like the goddess Kali, I have learned how to strike back at things that try to pull me down. And I really love this artwork. I really love my tattoo. Um, this sketch was signed by the person who also did my tattoo. Um, she made this particular picture f specifically for me at the pla place where I had it done. And um, I've um, decided to start looking into her a little bit more. I have books here on Kali. This one is the Kali um, Goddess of Creation and Destruction, a book that talks and tells the story of Kali Ma. And then I have this one here, which is the feminine force which also talks about how to apply Kali in your everyday life and her fe feminine force that gives the story of her and I'm going to be adding more and more books on her I think because she mean this entity actually has played quite a special part in my life with things that I've had happen in my life and if it wasn't for this particular identity I probably wouldn't be here today so anyway, short videos it is, everybody. This is what I've been up to. I got my tattoo. I wanted to show you the pictures and the ske sketches of her. I wanted to share this with everybody because I thought it would be interesting for a different form of video. Tomorrow, however, we will be back with some more of these girls and their story. So no, I haven't given up on Bassica, Raven, Gypsy, or Penelope. Nope, they're right there in their own little corner. As you can see, I set a, their own little spot up to them. And we will be back with some more story on them. Or maybe even a dolly dress up with possibly Raven. What do you think, huh? So anyway, if you see this video and you like it, like, share, and subscribe. Toodles!